Hello guys and welcome back to Sincerely Grace. So today I have a video that I think might be interesting to some of you guys um, if you're contemplating on getting certain items. So I wanted to do this video because I find these interesting myself. I like to know what people regret buying as far as luxury items or what items they really don't get that much use of. So today I am sharing those items with you guys in no particular order. So let's get started. So I want to start with some items that I've just fell out of love with or that I don't use anymore. So my first pair is shoes, pair. <laughs> so um, if you've been watching for me for a while, you know that I love sandals. I love, love, love sandals. And these were actually one of my first pair of luxury sandals. So let me show you what I'm talking about. So they are the Valentino um, Slide Jelly sandals. I don't even remember the correct name. I don't even know if they're still available. If they are, I will link them down below. So I've had these probably for about three years now. And whenever I first got them, you would see me in them probably every other day because I just love them that much. Um, I still like them, I just don't reach out to them anymore. Um, they're still very cute, um, but I don't know. I just, I I cannot remember the last time that I wore these, to be honest with you. And I don't know if it has to do with me expanding my collection for sandals. That might have to be why as well, but I've had other sandals for a while before these that I still managed to work into my rotation. However, I just don't reach out to them anymore. Um, another thing is that if you do wear these for a while, they can get a little bit uncomfortable. Um, so yeah, guys, I've had these for about three years. I probably haven't worn them maybe once within the last year. So I don't think I'm going to sell these. I think I'm probably still going to hold on to them to see if I have a change of heart. I do see myself wearing these if I go to a beach or if I go on some tropical vacation just because they are jelly sandals. I mean, they're designer. They'll they'll elevate your look, of course. Um, so I might want to save them to see if I use them. If not, who knows? I might need to part ways with these. But this is the first item that... I'm just double guessing my purchase because my cost per wear is not where it needs to be. Okay guys, so my next item is a purse and it is my Speedy 35 in the Damier Ebene print in the regular Speedy. So this is not a bandolier. This is actually, and I think it has some dust from, from me having it in my closet. Um, I probably have not worn this for a good maybe year and a half and I always try to factor it into my rotation especially during like winter and fall just because I feel like this print is more suitable for those times of years um, but this is my first purse my first luxury designer purse that I ever purchased and I'm saving it to be honest I'm saving it for my daughter I plan on passing this down to her. Um, it's still in really good condition. Um, the corners aren't cracking or anything. Um, some of the hardware does have some like tarnishing, but overall, I mean, this bag has held up really, really, really well. Um, and it just sits in my closet. So I have not worn it. I think that I would probably wear it more if it was a bandolier option because I do love top handles, but I love top handles that give me an option for a shoulder strap or a crossbody strap. Um, but this is the 35. I mean, even if I bought some kind of like handle from Louis Vuitton to like add here, I think it's too big of a purse to actually wear it in that style. But yeah, guys, I have not worn this for a while and it actually makes me sad to say that. So yeah, but I don't plan on selling it anytime soon. Okay, and the next items are actually recent purchases that I made that I thought I would actually 
get use of them. And what I mean by that is I have actually not worn them or used them. So the first item is this in this cute little box. So I had this item on my wish list forever and I went on a trip to Vegas. Ooh, when was it? Was it this year or was it last the end of last year? No, it was the end of last year. So it's been a year since I've had this and I have yet to wear this or use this, which to me is kind of disappointing. I, I, I need to incorporate it into my purse. And it is this cute, cute little card holder. So it is in the, um, I say on um, leather? I don't know. I will go ahead and link it down below. Um, I think they still actually make this. Um, so it is a very simple card holder wallet, I you can say. Um, so it does come with this main compartment here. It's very open, so it can hold quite a bit of cards. And then it has this front slot here. And it just sits in my closet, guys. Doesn't get any use except look pretty in my closet. So I need to find a way to incorporate this into my day-to-day. I don't think I'll ever sell this to tell you the truth just because I just love the way that it looks. I'll use it eventually, hopefully. I don't know, we'll see. <laughs> so this is one of the items that I purchased that I have not used yet. And it, this one makes me sad. So one of the items that I am so surprised that I have not used because I have this in a different size and I use it every single time I travel, go somewhere overnight, use it all the time. However, this item is sitting in my closet in this box and it is kind of getting dusty. Um, how long have I had this? Maybe a year, maybe about a year. Um, but this one makes me sad. It, it, it actually surprises me because I've used the other items so much that I thought for sure I am going to get use out of this. And it is the toiletry, I think this is 19. Yes, the toiletry 19, I want to say. It's my receipt in here. Okay, let me see. So... Let me see what it is. Yes, so it is a toiletry 19. Yeah, so it is a toiletry 19. Sorry guys, I just get so confused with these. And these are actually not available anymore. So I snagged these right before this price increase the beginning of this year. Yeah, the beginning of this year. I ordered these, this, and then I ordered the Clee Clay from um, Louis Vuitton. And I am just so surprised that I have not used this because I use the size after this, the toiletry 26 all the time and I love it. Yeah, I am just surprised that I just have not used these. And this is a good size pouch. I knew for myself that I was never going to order the size beneath this, this toiletry. I want to say it's 15. I don't even know. Um, but there's a smaller size than this. And I was like, no, nothing can fit in there. I'm never going to buy this. But I do, I did know that I wanted to have the toiletry 26 and the toiletry 19 in my collection. I'm just very sad I have not worn this. I probably will utilize this maybe sooner than later, but... It's just been sitting in my closet and it is a big, big disappointment. But anyway, guys, I wanted to show you guys everything that I've had for a while that I have not used just to give you a little bit of insight. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, give this a thumbs up. And if you like these type of videos, please consider subscribing. I will see you guys next time. Bye.